Yo, Swag Nation, how are you doing? Last night, while coming back from work, I was robbed at gunpoint around Ibulo Kitty. I was riding in my car with my colleague Georgina Ibe and um, um, Cher Twins, and we were robbed around Ibulo Kitty. At gunpoint, they stole everything, took everything, phones, ransacked the vehicle, took our footwears, and, um, you know, even some shoes, production shoes from my car. Stole my, um, my bag with my passport in it and some personal belongings, my PVC, ID card, a lot of things. You know, while approaching the road, they blocked, these are robbers blocked the road with a um, tree trunk. So I saw it from a distance and then I stopped in the middle of the road. And then I noticed from the bushes, the guys, they jumped and they started racing towards my vehicle. I put my car in reverse, stepped on the accelerator. The next thing I heard behind me was Boa. Imaume was behind me. Other my colleague riding in his own vehicle. So I had to hit him, but he didn't know what I was reversing for. So the guys immediately, I, I turned to look in, uh, ahead of me. They had already reached my door, opened the door, pointing a gun at my forehead, bro. Say, so lie down, you know. So we all laid down on the floor. They stole, took our personal stole after doing their doings. Cars were passing, you know. <laughs> People were passing, I'm not joking, while we were on the ground. And they were like, ah, that junior pop, or that junior pop, ah, he move, eh? you know? But yet, they... so these guys actually recognized us. My brother, I covered my head with my hand, you know, facing down. And I said, I should come and open the boots. The moment I wanted to stand, the guy said, lie down, you know? He noticed the boot was open, so he stole my shoes, my footwears. But... It's not funny. And to blow Kitty. And then when they said we should drive away, we drove. On getting to the um, customs checkpoint, we reported there. The customs actually told us that the first set of people had come to report passengers that they were stabbed and injured. So you see, it's a regular occurrence on that same spot. It's not like the police don't know. I'm very sure they know this. So I'm calling on the Pol Commissioner of Police, Delta State, calling on the Governor um, of Delta State, Ifa Okowa, to please do something about this because, because the Governor, Ifa Dr. Ifa Okowa, has done a great job when it comes to security in Delta State as a whole. But this particular spot, those customs officers were actually telling us that it's a regular, like, they, they, it's, it's a regular occurrence, you know. And then while we were still there, we left Georgina Ibe, you remember? So the location boss coming from behind saw her, the one she actually told us that they wanted to rape her, but she was an, in a monthly flow. So the guy slapped her and then told her to leave. So the location boss saw her walking on the express around 11 p.m. That's the time this stuff um, actually happened. So they picked her up and then we, they now met us up at the customs um, checkpoint. And um, while we were still there trying to organize ourselves, some other vehicles came and also gave a report that they are still robbing some other person. So it's um, so I urge you all. My message is I urge you all to get your PVCs. I lost my mind in the robbery, but I I guess I'll find a way to see if I can still um, get it, uh, a new one back. Because vote I must. Uh, thank you guys uh, for, I mean, disregard any communication as regards WhatsApp, anybody chatting you, blah, 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 until I'm able to retrieve everything. Thank you guys. God bless you, Swag Nation. I love you all. Booyaka.